By the grace of Allah, the Ahmadi Muslim Jamaat in French Guiana held its sixth Jalsa Salana on the 8th and 9th of December 2023. The program consisted of two sessions. Following Jamaat traditions, we performed the Hajjad prayers in congregation, seeking God's blessings for the success of our annual gathering. The first session commenced on December 8th after the Jummah prayer at the national headquarters of the Jamaat. Following the Friday prayer, members were requested to move to the compound for the flag hoisting ceremony. The president and missionary in charge had the honour of hoisting the Jamaat flag and Mr Abdul Aziz, president of Khudamul Ahmadiyya, had the honour to raise the flag of France. During the ceremony, members continued to recite prayers in the Ruz Sharif. The programme concluded with a silent prayer. Subsequently, members moved back to the prayer hall to attend the opening session of Jalsa Salana. The first session was presided over by the president and missionary in charge. A Syrian Ahmadi brother, Mr Salah Muhammad, had the honour of reciting the Holy Quran. Following that, Mulana Muhammad Basharat recited the poem of the Promised Messiah in Urdu with his melodious voice, providing the French translation of the poem. After the recitation of the Quran and poem, the session's president delivered his opening speech, explaining the objective of Jalsa Salana as elaborated by the Promised Messiah. He also conveyed the message from our beloved Imam for our Jalsa Salana in 2023. According to the program, the second and closing session was held at the famous Mercury Royal Amazonia Hotel. As expected, members and guests started arriving at 3.30pm and the reception committee guided them to the main hall of the conference. Exactly as planned, the program commenced at 4 o'clock. The closing and last session were presided over by the president and missionary in charge. Mr Abdullah Rasul had the honour of reciting some verses from the Holy Quran followed by an Arabic poem written by the Promised Messiah, which was presented by Mr. Abdul Aziz. After this Arabic poem, a group of children recited a poem in French. Following that, a video film produced by MTA International was shown on TV. Among the special guests was Lady Mayor Mrs. Sandra Troshimara. Additionally, Christian and non ahmadi Muslim guests were present as well, including Mr. Kafa Drame, the President of the Muslim Community. In the video, the message of Ahmadiyyad was wisely delivered to the audience. The message emphasised that the promised Messiah and Imam Mehdi have already appeared in the world in the person of Hazrat Mirza Ghulam Ahmed. The video shed light on the great work that the Jamaat Ahmadiyya is doing in the fields of the belief and social service for humanity by establishing schools, hospitals and water pump projects, particularly in Africa. The film included comments and impressions from heads of states, ministers and members of parliaments, stating that the Ahmadiyya community is an example in the world and their slogan, love for all, hatred for none, is wonderful and should be spread across the world. After watching this important video, the following guests addressed the assembly. Mayor of Cayenne, Mrs Sandra Troshimara. Mr Adgard, President of the African Association of French Guiana. He read out the message of Mr Jack Spurthy. Mr. William, President of the Chinese Youths of French Guiana, and Mr. Kafa Drame, President of the Muslim Community of French Guiana. After the speeches of the guests, our missionary, Muhammad Basharat, delivered his speech on Islam, religion of peace. He emphasised that the basic book of the Quran sheds a lot of light on this subject, clearly stating that there is no compulsion in religion. No one is authorised to use force to change a person's religion. Even abandoning Islam carries no punishment. A Syrian Ahmadi, Mr. Salah Muhammad, delivered his speech in Arabic, emphasizing that the Holy Prophet وسلم, was a grace for the whole world. If Muslims today follow the example of the Holy Prophet, وسلم, the world will become a cradle of peace. Following the Arabic speech, Mr. Abdullah Rasul delivered his speech on the subject the high morals of the Holy Prophet of Islam. In the end, Moulana Sadiq Ahmed Munawwar, the president and missionary in charge of French Guiana, delivered his closing speech. He very clearly informed the audience of the Messiah and Imam Mehdi, who was to appear in latter days, has already come in the person of Hazrat Mirza Ghulam Ahmed. After his demise, the system of caliphate was established, and at present we are in the time of the fifth caliph, Hazrat Mirza Masrul Ahmed. In the conclusion of his speech, the president presented an extract from the book Al-Wasiyyat by the Promised Messiah, 
in which he called on Ahmadis to be steadfast in all kinds of persecutions to win the pleasure of Allah. Mawlana Sadiq thanked the audience for accepting the community's invitation and the session was closed with a silent prayer. After attending the conference, the participants moved to the Quran Expedition Hall, beautifully decorated with charts, banners and stats containing holy words of the Quran and sayings of Prophet Muhammad wasallam. Notably, the Quran, with nearly 70 language translations, was exhibited on tables for the first time in this hotel. Additionally, books on Islam and Quran copies were given as gifts to many persons in this expedition. In the end, all attendees enjoyed a delicious Lebanese dinner prepared by the hotel, making it a great experience for all participants. Everything went well, and thus our sixth Jasa Salana came to an end. Alhamdulillah.